Hayley McQueen, it's the ninth Football League Awards, but it's your first. How much are you looking forward to it? It is my first. It's my first on the stage, but not my first. Normally I'm in the audience, having a little drink, watching other people present it, not really thinking too much about what they're doing, but about the award winners. Whereas tonight I'm having to think about lots of things, but it is super exciting. Can't wait to just get up there and hand out all the awards and see all the happy faces and see everyone celebrating. And how are the nerves holding up? Obviously there's plenty of nerves in the, in the auditorium at the moment with a yeah. lot of nominees there. How are your nerves personally? I think it might be worse if you're a nominee not knowing whether you're what you've won or not people might think oh it's tough because you're presenting it and you're having to remember so much but actually to be sitting there wanting to relax knowing that you can have a little bit of a drink and let your hair down but then maybe not too much because you have to get up and give a big speech or something thinking oh my gosh how on earth am i going to chat to Haley mcqueen and manish to see what they're going to ask me and how important are these awards to our 72 clubs in the football league I think these awards are hugely important for 72 clubs because you're awarding things not just on the pitch but off it. As we know, the Football League doesn't get as much press as the Premier League. Um, yes, on the pitch, you've got the Football League show, Sky Show, I think we've had 90 live games so far this season on Sky. We will have by the end of the season, so that's exciting, cover the Johnson's Paint, Capital One Cup as well. But the headlines on the back of the pages, no matter what's happening in the league, tend to go to the Premier League clubs. So it's nice to celebrate achievements on the pitch, but specifically off it with the community awards and supporters awards and people that you don't hear about, the people that aren't appearing in the back pages of, of newspapers.